Welcome, welcome. Mezzo, welcome in. Wow, it's funny you should say that. I'm just doing. <laughs> Dux has updated the calculator. We've got access to a beta version of the calculator now. I'm just inputting some things. I need to input the blue skies delivery service. Tent span around blue skies delivery, blue skies made purple paper. This needs blue skies made morning paradise is twenty two million or twenty well, I'm thinking about doing away with coffee because it's just the biggest ball lake in the world and you only get we're getting 440,000 from the level fours. weak panorama. I don't think we're going to be getting at any panorama actually. Some of them will be, but I think we're going to have to delete that. Seven thousand tons of coffee only gives us four hundred and forty thousand. <clears throat> Hmm. 
I mean, chewing gum, we can turn that on. Billiard tables and violins, because they're going to be getting that. They're going to be getting that from the item. Biscuits are not worth it. Cognac's not worth it. Neither is toys. This is the big one. The overseas mail. We get four million from that. A million from perfume. A million from fans. Nearly 800,000 from the film reels. So these are a must. Now as for the basic goods. Coffee we could virtually do away with because it gives the less population out of all of them. Same for light bulbs. This would drop down. Just under 20 million investors. Cigars. Probably cigars we could do that. 1,664 tons a minute. 1,664 tons of cigars, okay. Oh, cigars, let's have a look. Okay, so... Salvador Starwater can now affect cigar factories. Total Lucia is a must because it's timber instead of Now we can electrify timber in the new world as well. Holy fuck. Let's do a quick plan for cigars. See if it's realistically doable. I'm just going to be messing around with some stuff today. We're going to be taking a look, making a plan. I don't want to trade for anything. I want to try and make it. I want to try and make as much stuff as possible. So, cigar factory. Now, if they're electrified, you definitely want to use this fella because he's 100% gives extra goods. Now, can they be clipped? Never thought about clipping a scar factory before. They can. Could be interesting. No, that's seven. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So they can't be clipped. Fair enough. How do we use this item transfer thing? Guessing we need to put them in Crown Falls first.
There's this Salvador. We don't have any of him, apparently. And to the front. Apparently there's 500 here on Crown Falls. So her, and it's going to be Salvador. We're not bothered about anything else. He's 100% boost and the extra goods, which is freaking crazy. This fella's room changes the number of workforce, but I mean, I mean we're not workforce is not going to be an issue. So the next best one is a Ferris. And we have one of those Manola Fab. This is just for testing purposes. Obviously, I wouldn't just build this like this. Just gonna see what boost we can get out of it. With it being electrified. And we'll input the figures into the calculator. See where we're at. So that's one hundred fifty, forty, and two hundred. Three ninety. Three hundred and ninety for a cigar factory. 
Is this taking into account the cigars that our sisters need as well? They don't need any, which is good. It's a luxury. So we're only going to have to make them physically for the investors. So, cigar... <laughs> Factory. Yeah. 390 213 with Tour de Lucia Salvador Stewart this isn't going to work because Salvador changes him let's put no 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 we're going to have them anyway get 7 tons a minute from Kahina Workforce, it's not going to matter because it's changing it to the Artisters. We're going to have plenty. So it's 160. It's a lot. But the input is going to be a lot less for tobacco. 1,248 tons a minute for tobacco. We can get some cocoa, caoutchouc, and cotton back from that. And it would simply be a plow. Ferrous. So a plow is 50, a ferrous is 50. She's a 20, so 120 on top of the other standard boosts that you get. The cigars. Tobaccos, sorry. 20. Plus a tractor burn. Plus a fertilizer, they give 100 each, so 420. This is Brown the Cultivator. Hundred and fifty six point five eight tobacco plantations. That is a lot. It's a crazy amount. You can't make tobacco in the Haciendas for some reason. Can you? No. We can make tobacco from our corn though. Gonna need a shit ton of that for the celluloid. Delete the blue sky, blue skies guy, because I've got a funny feeling he's taking into account the chewing gum, lid tables, and violins, because the celluloid was at two thousand something, and it wasn't nowhere near that. Still saying two thousand. We're getting a thousand when we clip him. He's going to be at one, two for the electric celluloid.
So they're going to be 150. Plus 100 Blaze. Plus 100 Electric. So they're going to be at 350. That's 200 clipping points. Why do we need so much celluloid then? Because of this. 1,000 tons of fans, 788 tons of film reel. And... Yeah. That's simply it. It's the amount of film reel that we need. But these film reels, these can use Salvador as well. And I think these can be clipped. Clipping, yes, Salvador. Yes. So we're getting loads of extra goods from that as well. Referum Dav is 50. If I remember right. Chemical plant film reel. So this can use Salvador. Professor Rum Devi. He provides electricity, so that is a wicked boost, which means we can have these clipped on an island with no electric. That is very, very useful. So Rum Davi. Salvador makes it 150. Double redundancy is plus 50, but you get all these weird bonuses that you don't want. So we can now use a ferrous on the Caracal Plant film reel. Okay. This is a flat 50. Oh, ferrous. So 150, so 200% plus the 100 blaze plus the 100 electric is 400 for the film reels. It's 252 clipping points. Holy fuckness. Okay. And factory. Bruno Ramdevi, science whiz. Too sure about the science whiz. Man, these take up so much space. So much stuff. Look at it. These are the mission. We're going to have to trade for stuff, whether we want to or not. We're going to have to trade for rubber. Gonna have to try for the steel. Gonna have to try for the corn. You tried for tobacco. Yes. Okay, so we could try for the tobacco, make cigars. This is looking better. 
what about if we say we're only going to train for raw materials or stuff in the first tier of a production chain? That could be fun, right? And steel. And we say we don't make stuff specifically to trade for things. We're only going to use byproducts. Like the 300 tons of rum that we're making. And we'll be making penny farthings and stuff and steel steam motors from Bruno and stuff like that. Could be interesting, couldn't it? Steel. Combustion chemist removes the need of coal. What does that do? Furnace. Instead of coal, the building processes Arctic gas. Interesting. Oh no, hey mate. How's it going? Instead of coal, the building process is Arctic gas. And you get goods back at a rate of one over two. Can the furnace be clipped? Can it? No. Lester. Lester, have you got a second account? Did you join the Discord under a different account called just Lester? Bono, <laughs> yeah. I'm trying to I'm trying to find a way to make this save appealing to me. I don't want to just do the arbitrage shit. Nope. It wasn't you. Okay, there's two Lesters now then. I'm thinking about making everything. That's what I'm just doing some plans for now with the updated calculator that Dux has done for us. I'm just inputting some things and seeing what we can trade for, what we can physically, what would be possible, put it that way, with the space we've got. I'm just doing some some basic calculations right let's have a look at these motor these cable factories uh, these use rubber and copper which can be traded for obviously penny farming strategy uh, I may, maybe not even that i may do something similar to my tourist run where i trade for stuff but only with the byproducts that we make from actual production lines that we've got going on so that i'm not physically making stuff to to trade are these cable factories looks like they just use generic stuff cable factory yeah so this would simply be a ferrous beckoning and a fortune eight so 50 25 and 35 is 110 Plus 100 base, plus 100 electric. Cable factories can't be clipped. They should be able to, but at the minute you can't. Or is this the one? No, there was some building I found that was. Two, four, six, two, four, six. This is one by six by seven, so no. So what did we say? 310 for a cable factory. That's 378. Cable factories. Oh my lord. 
Uh, if you're going down the arbitrage route, I think so, yeah. I'm going to go for just a 4 and 5 mix again, I think. That's a good point, actually. Let's. Uh, they're at level 3. They're at tier 3, aren't they? Is it both tier 3s, is it? Oh, I don't know. Didn't want to go down that route either. Then put it in and see. Do they both get intense panorama, yeah? They both get intense panorama, Bono, is that correct? Yeah. So, intense panorama. Um... And it's still going to be Blue Sky's delivery because he's going to give us chewing gum, billiard tables, and violins if they need them. Tier 3, we'll have to see in a minute. It's going to give us. It's going to give us violins and chewing gum. And then the papal paper. And this guy's made. Tense panorama, yes. Guys made, yes. Blue skies. Delivery service. Yes. Purple paper. Yes. Blue skies made. I mean, that's just shy of 20 million. I'll take it they need a lot less stuff now. Very much so. Way more stuff. Way, way, way more. Less stuff, sorry. This was like a million and a million. A million, a million and more. Okay, so we do that then. <sighs> the arbitrage system may be a lot more easier uh, to deal with now if we have to do this. Because each island is not going to need so much stuff. We're going to have to test it, aren't we? We're going to have to test a 3 and 4 mix, give them everything that they actually need. Uh, luxuries, we won't be giving them any of that crap. 
Might give him a bank. Population islands are you getting the fourth town slot? Yeah, I suppose we are. Unless we go down the route that I was testing a little while back where we use the uh Where we use the one that you boost power plants. I forget what it's called. We'll have a look in a minute. I did test an island where you use the palace policy for range boost on the power plants. This. 60 area of influence for all public buildings, 15 area influence for all power plants. That meant you could, with one gas power plant, you can pretty much do any large island in the old world. If I save this, exactly, Bono. That's why I got Wicked to prepare this save with plentiful mines so we have more gas mines in the arctic so we can get more gold mines in the arctic so we can make more gas as to what the official number is I'm not sure I don't know why that's just closed bear with me I wanted to load this save from an earlier point in time before I uh, messed around because I had prepared an island we'll have a look at that won't bother with cognac or biscuits it's just not worth it I mean is biscuits worth it not a thousand tons a minute no engineers need a lot of stuff guessing it's somewhere here it's gonna get a drink while this loads Hmm. 
Obviously, obviously wasn't this safe. It's confusing me. We'll have to test it on this save. Decisions, decisions. Yeah, this looks the way to go. It's like 13 mil and 7 mil. That's not giving them biscuits or cognac. If somebody can explain the uh, rotary arbitrage, you know, the one that uh, uh, Hebedib used in his save. If Oki can explain that to me and we can implement it, then I would have a crack at that. But I don't particularly want to make any ice cream. That's a big pain in the ass. Mezcal, again, I'm already making 400 tons of that. I'm making 420 tons of mezcal already. I don't really want to make another 500. I mean, this generates 90,000 pop. For engineers, it's 270. It doesn't take up an awful lot of space. I'd double that. 682 tons of ice cream. This becomes a pain. Medicine, I haven't even looked at that yet. Arsenal medicine. New rendering. It's quick. This uses more ethanol. What's the ethanol and the celluloid count at? 1,000 tons of celluloid. This will be clipped with Salvador. This will be clipped with Salvador. So 456. 132 tons coming from the Mezcal. 142 tons. Left and I'll come in from the medicine. How do we even make the medicine? It's just the embassin envoy. That's pigments I'm looking at. Where is the medicine? Here. Can't be clipped. I can't make use of the item that swaps the herbs out. We'd have to do some serious sums to see how much space the 284 
orchid farms, 294 herb gardens, 426 medicinal things, and all of this is it's not going to account to what we're getting back from the engineers, I don't think. 342,000. It's a lot, but it's going to take a lot of space to make all that stuff. Let's say, just from argument's sake, we don't do that. <laughs> I mean, 600 tons of shampoo is going to be a fucking massive pain as well. That is a big ball ache. You'd soap. Unless there's new items. Unless there's now new items for that. No, it's still the same. It's just double redundancy and re-rendering and they can be clipped. We know that from our last run, obviously. Re-rendering. Clipped. Skilled Labour Act. Productivity 470. It's only 40 clipping points. So yes, yeah, not the end of the world. And we need 55 clipping points for the souvenirs. I don't know who need the souvenirs. Is it the these new artistas? Do they need souvenirs? Yeah. They can be clipped. And they can use the re-rendering. And they're at 470 also. So it's only nine and ten. Okay, we're getting there slowly. Typewriters, two hundred and seventy-three tons a minute. Typewriter. Right. These can't be clipped. Be sure about that, unless I'm mistaken. No, and these are shit. I need an awful lot of stuff. I need lacquer. Six hundred and eighty two powered pastures to make the milk for the ice cream. It's just not gonna happen. I'm not just not gonna be making ice cream. Not having it. Nor the medicine. Mezcal maybe we can do. Typewriters is just going to be horrendous as well. Where's the lacquer factories? Yeah, 
2013. Maybe we could do the Detroit Rise. And that's a need. 273 tons a minute. Let's do a calculation of toll per ton. My star needs. Oh, it's 400,000 for the ice cream, 300,000 for the medicine but that is horrendous medicine it's probably the worst one I wonder if anybody's tested how well these bombs trade for and these sea mines obviously they have but Uh, there's re-rendering and get rich quick. Or oh, an item that gives them medicine, you mean, I doubt it. Medicine. What? Now, these are all items that have medicine in the expedition filter. That's annoying. There's not going to be any item that gives medicine. Yeah, that's what I'm looking for, Bono. Don't think so. Would have to be a new item or one that they adapted to give medicine as a as a byproduct from an existing item, but. Input change in the mesm factory. No, there isn't. You'd think it would make use of the item that changes the herbs, but... doesn't because the one that affects the Jalia kitchen is this dude and it affects Mezcal Bar Jalia kitchen perfume mixer apiary indigo farm uh, hibiscus farm and arsenal pigments so it does affect the arsenal pigments but not the arsenal medicine Changes the need of herbs from hibiscus petals, which is what we've been doing with the, which is what we've done on our island over here. So we're using hibiscus petals for the mezcal bar, and hibiscus petals for the uh, Jalia kitchen, instead of. So yeah, medicine is just horrendous. Can't trade for herbs, you can't trade for orchids. 
the FNL, it's not so bad because we can clip it. But yeah, an orchid farm. And it's the same fucking stupid item that you use for. Can't even use the uh, arborist or horticultural sermon to reduce the number of fields, so it's going to be. Uh, It's going to be a one, 120 plus all the other boosts, which is 100, 100 electric, 100 base, 120 is 220, 100 for the tractor, 100 for the silos, so it's going to be 420. That's that's not for this, is it? That's for the orchid farm. I mean, we do get a lot. Getting almost half the goods there. Four twenty, not seven twenty. Workforce will be at zero. We use Mrs. Brown. Hey, yep, what's this? Dr. Indigo Flores. Indigo. Um, it wasn't Indigo, it was Orchid. This reduces the number of modules. Orchid farm. Dr. Indigo Flores. Maybe I fucked up and I haven't researched him. Right. Doctor. He was a gold, weren't he? Indigo. Extra goods at a rate of one over four. Okay, why is he not showing? Okay, that makes a difference. So obviously we do away with Miss Brown the Cultivator. This goes to 400. He reduces the workforce a bit. Yeah, there is a new item for the calamari fishery. Oh no. It is this one. Quick to nab master's office affects all fisheries. So all your fisheries, fish oil, fish, uh, lobster fishery, gives calamari, fish, and fish oil back at rate one over four. But you need so little of the uh, calamari anyway. It's like when you clip these Jalia kitchens for a million bloody artistas, it's like nothing. I mean, what do I need? 100, 100 and summit. 122 tons, so... Good item, but not brilliant. All right, why is that only got one? 
Whatever one I just clicked on was missing an item. It's not clipped. Now it's getting double bubble. This one's missing an item. It's missing an Embassan Envoy. Am I gaining sugar out of the jelly of kitchens? No, Percival, I'm not. <sighs> These are the items that can affect a jelly of kitchen. I'm getting this dude. The Ambassador Envoy gives extra goods at a rate of one over two. So if you clip them, you're getting a good for free every cycle. Massive, massive, massive item. And also it changes the input. So I can use hibiscus petals instead of herbs. Big, big boost. It's probably the best item they've put into the game, actually. Crazy, crazy good. So when you clip it, you get two of him. So I'm getting an extra jallia at a rate of one over one. We clear out the warehouse, you'll see. Same thing goes for the Mezcal. If you check my YouTube channel, I did a video on why you would do this. Same for the Mezcal. I mean, the mezcal makes even more sense because we're getting ethanol, rum, and extra goods at a rate of one over two. So look, every cycle you get three, or one-ish, two. Every other cycle you get three. So it goes one, three, one, three. <laughs> Which is like two every cycle. And they work at six seconds, so. Everything needs to be clipped. Big, big boosts. So, yeah, with the orchid farms now using that cunning item that gives it back we only need 76 orchid farms to produce 1177 tons that's pretty damn good is it going to be the same for this herb garden yes dr indigo flores and we can use a herman on this as well to reduce the tiles even more 
which is interesting and we're going to get some great back so it's going to be 50 for the plow 100 base 100 boost 50 for the plow and whatever Herman gives us 100 base so it's 300 plus 50 plus Herman gives a plus 20 so 370 no he doesn't oh no 370 370 bear with me a second 370 productivity that's only 40 herb gardens to produce 568 tons okay well this medicine is not looking too bad now it's not looking as bad as we first thought put it that way But the 426.61 medicinal fucking things is pretty shit. The ethanol we can deal with. Arsenal medicine. I mean, double redundancies of 50. This is a 50, and a Ferris is a 50. So it's 150, plus the base, plus electric, so 350. And we'll be getting... Actually, we can use this. So if we do away with double redundancy... This is going to give us saltpeter as well. So we might have to go Ferras The ethanol book And re-render him So it's going to be 1, 2, 50 Plus those items that give us the extra stuff uh, Re-render and get which quick, yeah 250 so it's 170 and they're not very big it's not dr indigo it's dr inigo This is this is bug though because this should list orchids. Is that what they're called? The orchids farm. The orchid farm produces orchids, right? Missing fertility. Excellent. Missing fertility. Missing fertility. Orchid, yeah. So orchid farms produce orchid, and that item that doesn't show up anywhere when you search for him, but apparently it's there. You click items and search orchid. There should be a list here for just orchid, and then it would list him, but it doesn't. So apart from finding him within the bloody calculator that I just looked at. This fella doesn't exist. But he does. Did I count the electricity? Yeah, I did, yeah. Yeah, so 100 based, 100 boost, 50 for a ferrous. Then re render it and get rich quick. So, yeah, I've got more to add up, actually, haven't I? Medicine. So, a 20 and a 20. Plus a Ferras. Is 90. Plus your 100, plus your 100 is 290. 
So yeah, that's 147. Yeah, it does. Electricity does give 100 boost, 100. 100 base, yeah. 100 electricity is 200. Ferris, 50, 220s. 90, 290. 290. Thirty-seven orchid farms, forty herb farms. It's not bad. One hundred and forty-one. Well, I bet we can cram a lot of them around a trade union. They're they're going to have to go on here because you can't clip them, or can you? Another four by five. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, so you can't clip them. <coughs> I'm guessing we can get a lot. I'm guessing we can cram a lot around one of these. Yeah. Oh yeah, working conditions. Well done, Bono. That's 125. We've got two, four, six, eight. Thirty-two. So it's four clusters, that's all. Correct. This one has no road. Now we do. That one does that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. This isn't permanent, but we're just trying stuff.
Stick that on your anno layouts. Dot de. Go together pretty well, doesn't it? And on this island, it doesn't need any electric because it's all going to be powered. So this, realistically, could stay on here. weird it was phased inside the bloody one another one now that it phased inside the bloody building They need an awful lot of aluminium to make them, obviously.
Welcome, Jasper. Just messing with some ideas. Looking at the calculator that Ducks has made for us. Six. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. There's a hundred and fourteen. This says we need hundred and twenty five, so another nine. Two, three, four, five, five, six. Nine. That's a lot of medicinal pigmenty medicinal fucking things. Forty herb gardens, thirty-seven orchid farms. I don't really want to make them on this island. I haven't done the, any of the scenarios, just but fortunately, don't appeal to me. pretty good right what else did we have to deal with we were looking at engineers weren't we the medicine the ice cream was horrendous because of the sheer amount of electrified fields and there's no way you can make milk anywhere else Hang on a minute. Valentina Alvarez. That shouldn't be true, Jasper. They said that if you pause the main building, the powered pastures should still be producing. That is definitely a bug. They specifically stated that should not be the way. Uh, I'm just, I'm still in the testing phase, Parseval. I still don't even know in which way I'm, I'm doing things yet. I'm definitely not going to go for a full max pop run like Zizuno and the rest of them. I'm, I want to do something with a twist. But yeah, I mean, how much milk do we need? Because you can now make milk from Sanger Farms and Herbs. So I'm in Bessa. Will be useful again. Uh, 
let's just say we wanted to make uh, the ice cream. Bingo bongo. How much milk do we need? Yeah, they definitely. It was in the uh, in the live stream. If the pasture's electrified, they should still. Shall we test it? Ding ding ding. Uh, what makes milk then? These make salt peter. These are not making salt peter because it's full. I'll take it. A uh, cattle farm over here is going to make it. Let's delete a couple of these. Pause this. Yeah, that's definitely bugged out then. Yeah, I saw that you did that, Jasper. That is quite some achievement. So, not making any milk if it's paused. This shield should be working because it's showing the electricity. They said that it should be working. So that is definitely a bug. Would it be beneficiary to have the main building off with just pastures? <coughs> I mean... It's taking up the space, so you'd be a bit crazy not to use the goods that it's making. In my eyes. I mean, at the minute I'm just dumping the alpaca wool, but I will be using that later on to trade for stuff. But that is a good idea. I haven't thought of that. Because the pastures produce at 100% no matter what. Doesn't matter if the factories are boosted. They always take the four minutes. For the saltpeter anyway. Doesn't matter if these are boosted. Doesn't matter if they've got silos or whatever. That's why I've removed the silos from these. Because Proud Savannah reduced the number of fields. Silos were using corn, which was increasing the production of the alpaca wool, but doing nothing to the saltpeter. Um, Proud Savannah reduces the number of fields, which you think is a bit stupid, but I can fit more of these in. And it uses less dung. So yeah, it might be that that might be the way. No, what you just suggested, because they're only going to need. Yeah, you got my brain going now. I know the item you're on about. It's the horrible item that nobody ever uses, because it increases the number of modules. But this is what we want. We want more modules for the milk. Yeah, it's awful. It just doesn't make any sense. Because if you're not going to use the beef and you're not going to boost them with any items and you just want the milk, then yeah, definitely. This is the one because you're getting double the amount of fields for only one taking up one square, one four by four square worth of actual cattle ranch. I should be using this. Should be using this down there for the salt peter. Because at the minute, I'm just dumping the alpaca wool. 
and the rate they produce the only thing is does the does the dung is the dung produced by the field or by the factory the speed of the factory this is something i haven't tested because obviously we need the dung now we can test this quite easily I've got a feeling the amount of dung that is produced is to do with the Hacienda Fertilizer Works. Because they need to be in range of a Fertilizer Works to produce, make the dung, yeah? See how much dung we're making on this island. We are making 66 tons. Now if we remove the items from... There. We're making 51 tons, yeah, so it is affected. So the amount of dung they produce is affected by the overall speed that they work at, which makes sense. So for that reason, if you want to use the farms to produce dung as well as milk, then it probably still might make sense. Because you do get 100% boost from him yeah no no the more i think about it the more it makes sense not to use him still because you're only saving one tile worth a square he doesn't give any boost does he his 100 percent boost and he gives our pack all back No, this is hurting my brain. Give an 100% productivity 100 times the modules and you've still got two free trade union slots. Yeah, we're trying to work out whether it's redu it's worth using the Proud Savannah or not. 100 production, yeah. 100 base, 100 from the silo. 100 productivity for him and then you could have two 70s from two feed yards so it would be 440 let's take up the space of two arms um, why did we not use him before then has this been checked was he always 100 percent boost i don't understand why i didn't use him before because now he's giving more boost than any. He's giving more boost than any other item what you've got for an alpaca farm. It's doubling the amount of modules, but you you're not needing. You need more land, yeah, but. But it's only taking up the land that another one would. And using less houses. It seems like he is actually pretty good. Right, let's get old Marky Vandermark down here. I'm going to do some quick testing. Because he is looking pretty damn good. Mark. Mark Van Der. Versus the free feed yards. Which is obviously the best setup. Product productivity wise. Hello Mike. Chief. Welcome back. <laughs> We're depth in the mist. Depth in the mist. Is that even the same? Deep in the midst of general waffling and testing lots of weird shit. Oh, I 
I can't do that. It's annoying. Okay, right, let's remove the proud savannah. Proud, whatever it's called. Just for an instant. Let's build a ca singular cattle farm with a silo with six fields. It's going to be 12 fields though, isn't it, with him in? Not even going to have enough room to build that. Not just here we ain't. Not unless we do this. So that's our six. So that's your basic setup with the other feed yard. So that's three feed yards, six fields and a silo. How I can so many items. I use that cheat cheat mud thing. I'll show you in a bit. So we produce that produces six tons of beef. Yeah. So if we swap out the worst feed yard. Put marking marking. It'll be double the fields, but we'll be saving on input of a silo and we'll save a square for an actual doodah. This needs to make 12 tons for it to be warranted. Otherwise it's just not worth it. Make six still. What the fuck done him right? From the trade room and you can add the item specialists. I don't know what you mean, Mike. How have I got all the items over here, like? How have I got all these? It's a cheat item, it's a mod. You uh, build a sailing ship ha ha sailing shipyard, click on this item and it puts like 50, 50 of nearly every item in your inventory. Super cool. Still six tons. What the? I mean, it's probably six and a bit because it's only giving us an extra 30% boost, doesn't it? So, yeah, it's just not worth it. Yeah, from the transport depot. So, you have to have. You have to have a uh, airship platform and then you have to have the island transfer depot. Oh, what? How come I've got these eight slots or all of these? 
I don't know, it's telling me I've only got eight slots. I've got eight slots available, I don't know why. So yeah, it, it it's as we thought, it is shit. Because it's taken up twice the space and we only get an extra 30% boost. But it probably is good for the milk. Two slots per depot. Yeah, let's check the milk production. Let's check milk production. Twelve, yes. Solo doesn't affect milk production. No, it does not. So yeah, I mean, if you don't want the beef and you just want the milk, then this dude is a must because it's saving you the whole space of a farm. It's saving you workforce. It's saving you everything. Maintenance cost. So this is 12 tons of milk. Very good for milk. Yeah. And it'll be good for the saltpeter as well if we don't need the alpaca wool for anything. Just thinking dung-wise how it, how it affects. I mean, this says we're making 30 tons of dung at the minute. So if we remove him, Maria, Marai, thanks for following. Welcome in. Yeah, I mean it's just going to reduce the number of fields, isn't it? So it, it's not going to be very effective. You're only getting an extra thirty percent boost, and you're still going to need nine tiles. I mean, we can try it. Twelve out of five. It says reduces number of modules by twenty-five. Oh well, that's bugged then. Oh no, it's not. Ten. Yeah, so we're only reducing to. I thought I still had marking Jasper. So yeah, we're only losing two tiles for a 30% boost, so it's just crazy. It's not worth it. Yeah, you don't have to drag and drop the items from airships. If, if it's in there, you can use them directly from the trade union, really. Is that true? Let's put him back in there then and see. So yeah, we've come to the conclusion that if you want the if you want these just for milk then the mark's the man because he's doubling the amount of fields for only one input it's not showing it here you don't have to drag and drop the items from that airship store if it's in there you instantly use the item directly from the trade union well i've just put him in there oh yeah he is there look 
Well done. Thank you, Krads. Krans. Kranzius. Thank you. Good tip. So, yeah. Anywho. Mark Van der Mark. Can he be used on Sanger Farms? Yeah, he can, but there was this weird item that we found that creates milk from Sanger Farms that we're researching over here that doesn't show up anywhere because it was a bug. This fella. Dr. Inigo Flores. Nope, it wasn't him, was it? There was another one. Items. Milk. You only have to wait till the item is fully transferred. Nice. This woman here. Gives milk from Sanger Farms at a rate of one over three. This guy is sick. Yes. Valentina Alvarez. I think it's a lady. Yeah, personally, I'm going to need all the space in the new world that, that I can for population to provide mail to the investors. So if I have to waste half of Mbessa to make milk, I will. Simple as that. I will just simply do it. Let's have a look at Sanger. Bam. Mark, we don't want him. This dude produces beef, which we don't really need. This one actually reduces the modules of a Sanger farm. So 20% less modules. So that's going to be a four module farm. So yeah, that's going to be the way to go. It's one over three. How much milk do we need? lot there were more items was there more items that have milk as extra no just that one Transius. thanks for the follow dude welcome in and if you did have isabel you could buy her but i don't unfortunately but you can research it in the institute and this also gives her herbs back as well of a rate of one of our eight and we do need herbs for this medicine we need herbs here we need 568 tons of herbs so i mean is there a way to say that we're going to make milk via How much milk will we need to make? How much sanger? We need to know how much sanger we need to make to do that. If it's one over three, it's every third cycle. And we need 682. That's 2,046 tons of sanger cow. Oh boy, this one only gives plus 20% productivity, but it reduces the modules, so we're going to need to use it. And then we need this one, which is plus 50% boost, increases the workforce by a lot. And it's going to have to be this one to reduce the workforce by 60. This is going to be all of Mbessa, and it's going to be stupid, and we need Mbessa to clip cotton as well. How does it think we're going to make the milk? Yeah. How do it think we're going to make the milk? Six hundred and eighty-two powered pastures. Note: 
this is fucking bonkers. Bonkers. Apply globally. Global bonkersness. 682 powered pastures. Am I planning with or with with or without new more commute peers? I'm using them at the minute, Jasper. It's not going to be an issue though, because everything uses the new artistas and it's all every island's going to have artistas on. Yeah, I know. That's what I was just thinking, Bono. The population for those Sanga farms is going to be bonkers, isn't it? I mean, what's the population of what's the fucking population of the whole of I've got like 300,000 for the global population of Mbessa. Now, if we give the ice cream to these engineers, it's 396,000. Plus, if we use it for cotton also to produce celluloid to give the investors their reels and fans is another... 1.2 million so if the whole of Mbessa has to be sacrificed for cotton and milk then so be it it's it is what it is it's still worth it <laughs> you're mad isn't it I'd love to do it I would love to just sit for two weeks and just build Sanga cows in the whole of the new world. <laughs> Crazy, eh? This is what we're aiming for, guys, anyway. If we do, we're probably going to end up going down the arbitrage route because we won't have no choice, but we're aiming for roughly 8 million engineers, 13 million investors, and 2 million artists. So... 20, 20 million plus. Lobster fishers for calamari, true. We discussed this earlier, Bono, though. The amount of calamari you need is so small. You only need, I only need 242 tons of Jalia stuff, which I'm already making. I'm already making that on this island because they're clipped they only need half the amount of squid they only need 126 tons of squid it's like nothing it's not worth shipping it in from another region you can just have it on the coastlines not you know what I mean it's no bother so Jasper you're going to report this item not showing up then You are the man for reporting bugs. This one. Dr. Inigo Flores. Yeah? Extra goods. Orchid farm, herb garden. Items. Orchid. Farm. Oh, he's here. Take it back. I'll take it back. The reason why I thought that this wasn't showing up is because I thought he gave orchids only, but he gives back extra goods. So he gives back orchids and herbs. Affects orchid farm and herb garden. So typing in orchid, you think he would show up here, but he doesn't because... He doesn't just... He doesn't give a specific good. He gives extra goods back at a rate as displayed what's control shift s do it's doing some to my radion card what have you done yeah that's my bad Right, anyway guys, my brain's hurt. I've got so much to think about, I don't want to start doing anything. We've 
touched on medicine. We've touched on something else. That's a nice pack. <laughs> Do you want to see it? We've done this on stream the other day. This is my beauty. This is the extent of my beauty building. It's a shrine to her Hugo Mercia. Nice though, eh? Bit of symmetry. And you use the general goods extra guy on milk. What do you mean by that? No, because milk only comes from the pastures. It's the only place you can make it, isn't it? Apart from... Uh, There will be spies among us. Yeah, I know. I've tried to speak to him. He's not replying to my messages. I wanted to have a chat with him. He's, he's going for a rough time. Bless him. I mean, that item is giving us milk, isn't it? Sanga farm. Uh, it was this dude, weren't it? Loving Cattle Herd is the one that reduces the modules. And this one, Valentina Alvarez. So, milk it, I write one of the three. Herbs. So, we can get a. We can get herbs at a rate of 1 over 8 from these milk made by the Sangle things and the rest we can use the... This fella. No, we can't. This is a substitute, but it doesn't affect the medicine. We've got over so much today, my brain... My brain can't keep up. Can the, this fellow extra output be used on milk farms? There's no such thing as a milk farm, Jasper. It's just an electrified pasta. No items affect pastures because it's linked to the actual farm. So f f it would have to be a beef. Cattle, whatever it is, cattle farm. Oh, goat's milk. Yeah, no, you can't use him on that. You're on about goat's milk. Goat farm. Get dung from a goat farm. Yeah, goat's milk is classed as a drink. That's why you can use the ethanol book. Yeah, affects all cattle farms and sanga farms. So cattle farms in the old world, new world. And a sanga farm, which is a, a cattle farm, isn't it? What well, the seed of this game, Chief Mike, if you are a member of my Discord, you go to Anno Discussion Pinned Messages. It is this one. This one. 3942247982. Wiki prepared it at my request with max fertility so that we get more gold mines in the Arctic so we can make more gas. It's in there, you can download it for free. It's all prepared, ready to go with scholars and enough scholars to get you going. Well, I haven't deleted any of the scholars, so this is the save you get. Enough 20 million research points, but then a million plus in the bank. Good to go. Anyway, guys, I'm going to jump off. No problem. Yeah, just join the Discord, Mike. Exclamation mark. Discord.
if you haven't joined already. There's three other seeds over there that are prepared as well, pinned to the uh, Anno discussion. There's the German record seed, what I did my tourist run on. And there's another one also. Get what they were. These ones, 1302629524. That's the one. This one, 39422498. And then the German record seed. Yeah, anyway, thanks guys. Sorry, I'm lagging a bit today. I haven't actually built anything. I've spent two hours just talking and waffling shit. I hope you've enjoyed working through some stuff for me. It needs to be done sometimes. Sometimes you just gotta bash some bash some ideas out. I join, but I'm not using it very much. What the Discord? Well, you don't need to use it, mate. It's just there as a resource if and when people need help. It is very active. There's people in there all the time. I always post in there when I'm gonna stream as well, so it'll be useful just for that. But yeah, anyway, guys, thanks ever so much. I'm going to get off now. I will be on again on Thursday. We'll get some more done on Thursday. Probably start working on that medicine or something stupid. Maybe another good that the, uh, the art sisters need. Yeah, I'm going to jump off now. I'm going to play an hour or so at PUBG with my mates. Just chill out. And then I'll be back at it. I'll fill that in another day. Yeah, okay. Thanks, everybody. I will see you Thursday.